Hi guys, welcome back or welcome if this is your first time here. I'm Madalina and today I have for you another recipe and this time it's a sweet one and it's a homemade chocolate bar that's filled with coconut and it's quite a bit healthier than the commercial counterpart and of course it's vegan and you need only three ingredients to make it so let's make it and before I'm gonna show you how to do it don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you like what you see and don't forget to hit the subscribe button also because you want to know when I upload new videos and now let's see the recipe as usual here's your ingredients card for a print screen and let's see what I used for a sweetener I used date paste but if you want you can use other sweeteners date paste will make your coconut uh, filling a bit more dark of course we need chocolate to coat the bars and for the filling we need some coconut shredded coconut this fine one and uh, to make the filling we just throw the coconut flakes with the sweetener in this case the date paste in a blender and blend until we have a crumbly kind of dough and uh, you may need to process it for a bit because if you process it more um, it's gonna have a better texture when you're gonna finish processing everything press it in a pan line with parchment paper and let it sit in the freezer for about 30 minutes until it firms up really well after half an hour you can start melting your chocolate and I'm doing this using the double boiler method I just bring some water to boil in a pot and put the chocolate in a bowl over the boiling pot and I stir until all the chocolate is really nice and gooey and just a lake of chocolate while your chocolate is melting cut your coconut filling into bars and then dip them in the chocolate or you can pour the chocolate over the bars like I am doing here but actually it's easier just to use two forks and dip the bars into the chocolate and then put them in the pan lined with parchment paper or with a silicone mat and let them sit in the fridge or freezer until the chocolate firms up and of course I've lost the footage of me doing it and sorry for that but you really need to try this because they are so delicious and also don't forget that you have the written recipe linked in the description box as usual so this was my recipe for this week and yes I'm holding a piece of my bar because I absolutely love them and yes I know they're not perfectly white as a commercial bounty bar will be but you can make them whiter using other sweeteners like agave syrup or I don't know rice syrup or other syrups but those are not that healthy and uh, I actually prefer the taste with the date syrup and I love it what can I say more I really really love it and it's so easy to make it's only three ingredients and if you like this a lot you don't need that much plastic so it's a bonus point and I don't know I like making things making things at home I love sharing them with you so <laughs> yeah that's why I'm doing it and mm, I have to eat this because if I don't I'm not gonna have any my husband loves them too like he can eat two or three a day and as you can see they're pretty generous in size and um, yeah they are delicious 
so you have to try them and uh, yeah that's it for today I have to finish this because it's amazing and um, before I forget if you like what you see don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and if you make this recipe or any of my recipes take some pictures let me know in the comments how you like them if if you made any changes to them if you have any requests for other videos or other recipes and I don't know let me know your th thoughts your ideas I really love hearing from you and I love reading your comments and responding to them and uh, yeah and if you're not subscribed to this channel don't forget to subscribe because I'm gonna post more videos more recipes and um, more talky videos but you'll see when I'm gonna post them thank you very much for watching and um, don't forget that you are awesome and I'm gonna see you in the next video until then bye and go vegan